Where does gold come from? This question has barked astrophysicists for a century, but they might finally have figured it out. The lightest of the chemical elements are produced right after the Big Bang. These then form stars which do nuclear fusion and that creates heavier elements up to iron. After that, there's a process called slow neutron capture that produces increasingly heavier elements. But that doesn't work for all the heavy elements. Some like gold, platinum and uranium require something called rapid neutron capture. For decades, astrophysicists thought that supernovae get it done and this this is where gold comes from. But it turned out that supernova explosions don't produce enough neutrons. Then they thought that neutron star mergers do it, but it takes billions of years until a binary neutron star system makes a merger. And we know that even the early stars already had gold, so where did that come from? Well, in a new paper that just appeared, astrophysicists say that part of this gold in the universe comes from magnetar flares. Those are like solar flares on rotating neutron stars, but the flares are much bigger and more energetic. They say that about 10% of gold on our planet comes from there. I find it amazing to think that all the atoms on our planet have such a long history.